Hey everybody. Hey everybody. I'm going to tell you why I'm moving. Why I'm getting a place out in Vegas. So, from really from the start that I was born, I really wanted to become not a singer, but I really wanted to like drop some, make a song or make songs in the studio and everything like that. But when I was a baby, I wanted to become a singer and a dancer. So when I'm growing up, like probably when I was um, 14 years old, I, be, I began um, having dance class at my school. First, it was one time a day. First, it was one time a week, like on the Mondays. And then the second year, it was three times a day, Monday mornings before school starts, before class, um, Tuesdays and Fridays, three days. So then everyone knew that I was good and everything like that. And then I started performing. <laughs> what the heck? My gosh, pause. I was. I started be. I started performing at concerts that I was school had that my school had. So those concerts were mostly at the end of the school year. So anyway, I started performing at the end of the at our concerts. At the beginning of it, I didn't like it because at the beginning of it, I got really I keep getting really nervous where I wanted to throw up and use the bathroom. So I say, you know what? Dancers have this fear. Every time, every time they get, get ready to get on stage. So I just have to believe in God. God's pause. So stupid. <coughs> yeah. So, I don't know what. Done. That's so loud out there. It's just so loud. I came in because it's just was, I'm not just loud out there with those sports. But anyway, we at my old school, we started to have the end of the year concerts and everything like that. At the beginning of it, I basically wasn't enjoying it. I would get so nervous, so nervous before I would come on stage. And I wasn't kidding the 
built up. I need that. I wasn't kidding. People saying, oh, you good, Kendra, keep it up or whatever. Even though I knew I was good. Even though the good dancers can't know that they're good, they still need other people to see it and then say something. So, I was mad and everything like that. So, but then when it became getting like, oh, I like it, oh, I like it. I started in, to enjoy it. I started to put my emotions on stage and everything like that. So I think like three, four years ago, we, my dance team performed, um, performed Cats in My, Cats My Breath by um, Kelly Clarkson forgot F forgot what it called by catching my breath. Like catching my breath, letting it go, turning my cheek and taking a song. Yeah, so after that, I was putting the emotion that I felt inside and I was getting it, put dancing to it like on stage and everything like that. So, I was thinking, I'm stronger when y'all say hateful things about me. Like, not y'all, like on YouTube, y'all like in my school, my teachers and the other students. I'm stronger than that and everything like that. So, I made my emotions came out and do the dance so I will make my moves strong and on point. So one time we did this dance called Can't Back, Can't Back Down from Can't Walk to the Final Jam with Demi Lovato. So we learned that sometimes in the dance concerts we only have we have a year like ten months to learn the dance before we show it to our family, friends and teachers. But that time we only had like only four months. So we had to get down to business. So we was Kids and taught the dance moves and everything like that. So every time for rehearsals, I know that I'm a. If you all don't know, I'm fast at learning stuff. Like if you teach me a dance move, a new dance move, I learn it quickly and everything like that. So. Anyway, the concert came up and I was the only one that like knew the move and I'm not disgraced and nobody but I looked around and everyone else that was dancing was staring at me for the next move and everything like that. Sometimes I don't kill and other times I do kill because I'm like saying learn it and remember it. So anyway and then when I was 15 years old I really got into I took a picture and I showed I just took a picture, random picture of flowers and uh, my mom, I sold it to my mom, I sold it to everybody and my mom said, oh that's so good, that's camel and good, you could 
be a photographer. So she brought me a camera and I started taking pictures of flowers, buildings, people, yeah, dog, cats, whatever. And yeah, and everything like that. And then with my painting and now YouTube. So I'm getting this apartment in Vegas for all of the things. I'm getting this apartment in Vegas so I can make good and improve YouTube videos. I can um, start my photography um, career. I could sell my paintings to more people, more people from my family. Because right now I'm just selling my paintings to my family and their friends. And I could do my dancing career. And fifth, I could hook up with my cousin that's a singer named Kevin Malachi. I'm going to do a whole video about her because y'all probably don't know her and everything like that. But anyway, I could hook up with my cousin Kevin and drop do songs. And everything like that. So, because one time she took me and my sister, me and my sister and our two cousins to the recording studio with her while she was recording a song. So now I know how recording studios work and everything like that. So, I'm going to get an apartment in Vegas because um, of that. Yeah, I'm still going to, I'm still going to, like, be here. I'm still, I'm still going to have everything, exactly everything in my room here. It's not, I'm not going to move some stuff out to there. I'm not. Everything going to still be here and everything like that. So, yeah. So, like, comment, subscribe, comment down below. Comment down below. What's your hobby? What do you like to do? So, yeah.